Today, I want to talk about the fear of missing out and how, as Christians, we shouldn't have it. Um, I realized a long time ago, although I, I wouldn't have called it the fear of missing out, that anytime I had that desperate, clawing, grasping feeling of maybe I was going to be left out or I was going to miss something that God had for me, that that feeling was not from God because God doesn't give us feelings of desperation. God gives us feelings of rest and peace and confidence in his promises. And um, anytime I pushed forward whenever I had that feeling because I was so afraid of losing something or missing something, um, my spiritual condition worsened. I, I didn't gain rest as I got closer to that thing. I gained more fear as I tried harder and harder to pursue it. But if I stepped back from that thing, instead of pressing forward into those feelings of fear, then I always gained more rest and peace and confidence in God. And he gives us two promises that are very applicable to this. Um, one is that he who has begun a good work in this is faithful to complete it. So whatever God is trying to accomplish in your life, he's not going to desert you in the middle of it. If he has called you to it, he's going to complete it. And the other one is um, that God works all things to good for those who love him and are called, in, called according to his purpose. So it doesn't matter what happens in your life. Your purpose cannot be thwarted. God says so. So anytime you have those feelings, ask yourself if you really believe those promises. Do you believe that God's going to complete the good work in, that he started in you? And do you believe that he is going to work everything that happens in your life to great purpose for his purposes. And uh, when I ask myself those questions, the answer is yes. And so then I have to decide how I'm going to handle that feeling of the fear of missing out. Am I going to push forward into it and keep grasping for that thing that I'm afraid of losing? Or am I going to step back and trust God that his purposes are going to come to fruition no matter what? So that's my word for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, subscribe to our channel below, or you can visit my website at cewhitebooks.com to see uh, the books I've written and my blog. And I have a book on faith coming out uh, within the next couple of months. Thanks so much. and Have a great week.